Welcome back to the studio. Today we have Piven Liu, co-founder of the Levain Group with us. Levain Group specializes in turnkey solutions for FMB in Malaysia and regionally. Piven will be sharing with us about how Levain solution is a plug and play for the future of FMB, where she will talk about turnkey solutions versus custom built kitchen solutions. So, hi, Pivian. Thank you so much for joining us on the show. Hi, Jen. Thanks for inviting. Okay. <laughs> yes. So, uh, before we start, right, can you tell us a bit more about Levain Group? I know that you specialize in turnkey solutions, but you also have other various businesses. So, tell us more about uh, Levain Group. Okay, basically um, under our roof, we have a group, uh, we have a team of master chef, okay? Mm. Um, except me, I'm not, okay? <laughs> all my partners, they are all the master chef in this line for more than 30 over years. Mm. And we do provide um, turnkey, as in from A to Z uh, mm. com uh, business setup. Right. So why, uh, what do we call about A to Z is because basically many people have dreams of setting up a FMB business, mm. but they do not know where to start, how to start, mm. and most importantly is a, uh, a common question is how, how much, much should I invest? You know, <laughs> yeah. okay. So yeah. this is because F and B is a uh, we can transform from a very small business mm. to a very large scale because right. we do set up like central kitchens and things like that. So when people come to it, basically we custom made mm. a whole concept solely for them. Ah, mm. right. So it's not it's not really a one size fits all sort of plug and play. Yes, it's customized. Yep. But then when you deliver it to the client, they can literally just plug and play. Correct. Right. Because everyone, okay. we have like a um, different dream. Mm. And some people tell me that, hey, I want to open up my own bakeries. I want to mm. open up my own cafes. Okay. Right. And some, they say, hey, I want to do like what you'll do to export. Mm. Uh, I want to open up a central kitchens and things like that. So we basically, we custom made, uh, we help them to um, A to Z is from site location sourcing. Mm and uh, renovation, we draw the layout for them, we help them to uh, uh, plan what type of equipment and machineries to do, right. and then also like um, how to do recipes, if let's say they do not have any recipes at all. They simply ah. say, I want to open up a cake shop, but I do not know how to make a cake at all. Right, so, so. it could just, it could very well fit into people who need to pivot, Yes. right? Or probably someone who is, people who have lost their jobs and they want to now start a business, but they have absolutely no experience in, in F&B and they can come to you yes. and you can just literally build the entire uh, kitchen setup and, and, the opera and, and would you also guide them in operations? Yes, we do. Uh, we, we will guide them, we will train them, we provide them with the SOPs as well. Just that wow. what we don't touch is the marketing side because we are not okay. the pro marketing, okay? So the marketing side, we leave it to the clients, okay? And the marketing experts around here. So that means you cover literally everything. That's why you say A to Z. Yeah, basically. Uh, and That's even uh, for those like they want to go for loan, they, they, they have the, they, you know, they have their dream of building up, mm -hmm. but they are lack of some financial aids. Right. So we do help them on that, on the final part as well. That is mm. so interesting, right? And uh, you've also got other, other businesses as well, right? Other than the turnkey solutions. Yes, we do. But uh, tell you what, Jen, instead mm. of I'm explaining, okay, <laughs> not in a very detailed form. Right. I actually have a very interesting clips okay. that probably um, can tell us like, what do our company do in a whole? Right, in a nutshell, that's interesting. Let's take a look at the video. Welcome to Levine Group. We are a company providing turnkey FNB business consultation, FNB equipment and automation, halal and HACCP consultation, frozen premium bread and pastry supply. Our professional services include machinery and equipment supply for all scale of food and beverage business setup including factories full line processing, drawings, equipment planning and recipe and technology transfer. Factory setup for all kinds of food related industries such as bread, cakes, confectionery, beverages, chocolates, cookies, pow and dim sum, ready to eat products, paste, sauce, frozen food products manufacturing etc. A to Z turnkey solution, from kiosk to shop, no matter small, medium or large scale. Bakery outlet set up, restaurant set up, food factory set up, cafe set up. Certification application, halal, HACCP, ISO, IGMP. Let us know, what's your need? We'd love to welcome you to be part of our happy clients.
Wow, they, you are right. You know, it's just one clip that tells you everything in a nutshell. Yeah. Um, so, so basically, people can come to you when they will have a dream or they want to open up an f and business, or maybe perhaps even they want to change the concept and they, mm -hmm. they can actually then come yes. over to you. Welcome. Right. I, I noticed in the video, you also do certification on food safety. So can you share with us about that part? Oh, sure. Because uh, recently we found out that uh, in Malaysia, right. okay, because we have been setting up projects uh, like um, overseas and Malaysia as well. So we found that that's a very lacking of food safety awareness mm -hmm. among um, local uh, FMBs because it's a very easy entry point. Everyone can actually enter into FMB industry without any knowing any kind of food safety knowledge and things like that. So where we come since it is where people want to apply for halal mm. and where people want to apply for HSCCP or BRC or FFSC, it might sound like alien words mm. to uh, most of the <laughs> FMBs, okay? But uh, over here, we do provide the um, entire consultation because we feel it's very important to actually um, know what food safety really is. Yes, yes. And for those like common words would be HSCCP, mm -hmm. where people know all oh, HSCCP, they simply apply because, you know, their customers require that, yes, okay? Yes. Or a but they don't mall. understand. Yes, they, they don't, don't understand. really understand what it entails and what it really means. Yes. Right. So basically, HSCCP is a certification for um, food safety assurance. So if let's say you want to open up a central kitchen or you want to open up a factory, so it's an assurance certificate for your clients that your food produced here are safe. I see. Oh. And you do that for the for the for the F and B owners. Yes, we do on the consultations. Right. If let's say um do uh, we welcome retailers uh to come over so that we can build a very food safety environment for Malaysian as well. <laughs> wow, that's really interesting, right? Uh, okay, so so it, it's it's interesting to look at the fact that you you basically offer is a one-stop solution, mm. right? Almost a one-stop solution because they don't do marketing. So one-stop solution and uh, together with certification, right? So your 90% of your, of your headaches are gone. <laughs> but before I go to the second question, um, I'd like to ask you, mm. what inspired you to start? this business 30 years ago? Uh, okay, well, <laughs> my partner started it 30 over years ago, okay? okay. But me, myself, because uh, my background was actually in nutrition right. and business, and I I opened up a cafe actually, mm. okay? In my, uh, during my uh, teenage time, right. okay? Where I think, eh, I want a place that I gather all my friends around, mm -hmm. okay? To enjoy, you know? Right. This is many people's dreams, okay? And it was my dream as well. Yeah. But I faced a lot of difficulties mm. because I don't even know how to cook at all, right. okay? So I uh, paid a lot of like um, unnecessarily, okay? So that is uh, where I get to know my partners mm. and they actually give me a very good, um, guidance and right. consultations because right. based on their experience. Mm. But what we found is a lot of like um, a lot of people that we dare not ask right. or they feel like people dare not want to share right. uh, or don't want to share. They mm. want to keep it by themselves. So when I met uh, my group of partners, they are like, oh, they are really willing to share. So it's like, I feel if let's mm. say I, I myself as an owner, okay, I face this problem. So there might be a lot of people around that they want to open up, but they right. might be facing this kind right. of problem. Okay, so your business is actually discovered through realizing and, and recognizing your own issues and challenges, yes. and therefore you created a solution, yes. right? Wow, that's really amazing. Right, so we understand that Levain Group also strives for efficiency in production and food preservation. So what we really want to find out from Levain Group is how do they help f &B owners achieve desired food quality while maintaining shelf life? Now that's interesting. And what about the cost? Does it, how does it help them save costs? Mm. You ask a very good question, okay? <laughs> where a lot of uh, f &B, especially during MCO and mm. pandemic, whereby um, we face a lot of problem. Mm. Uh, people can't dine in, okay? And they have to deliver out. Mm. But uh, when they deliver out, the um, food is not, um, I mean, they, it's not fresh, yes. okay? And they have a lot of complaints. Yeah. So this is where we are very actively um, helping a lot of uh, FMBs, uh, especially restaurants mm -hmm. and central kitchens on doing a proper frozen or we call it a food preservation method. I see. Because okay. when people talk about frozen, you right. know, um, 
there are people that they simply they do not they are very ignorant and they do not know uh, what is the proper way mm. they just like after cooking a food they put in a you know our old school <laughs> method okay they put in the freezer okay right. and then they serve that way to yeah. their clients but end up they receive a lot of complaints right. because when we talk about shelf life we are not talking about the food that uh, wouldn't get rotten it's like um it's freshly um edible mm. and um it's uh, at a safe level mm. okay and also it maintain the texture this is what we want to achieve right yeah. okay yes because i also know that you know the the particularly the frozen halal dim sum market mm. has just <laughs> mushroomed and yes. they're like so many people doing frozen halal dim sum right so the fact is that dim sum you know you like to eat it fresh mm -hmm. right at the restaurant how do you then have freshness in terms of quality from frozen frozen food right yeah. i think then it boils down to how you store it yep. isn't it correct very, very the entire, I mean, the entire process is important. Like, um, how do you actually prepare it, mm. and what technology that you are using? Because, uh, in Malaysia, uh, some people might think, "Hey, I, I want to do something, but I want to save on cost." Mm. But they do not dare to actually um invest in technologies. Right. Over here, we are creating a lot of awareness. We hold up seminars. We hold up a lot of classes to educate people or to share with people why do you need technology to actually transform. And it's no longer zaman dulu, okay? <laughs> you know, it's a, uh, it's a uh, now, uh, it's a uh, twenty twenty one, okay? And we faces a lot of pandemic, this kind right. of issues. So technology will actually helps you to a lot to actually um, uh, solve your problems course, on yeah. preservations yeah, and yeah, all these yeah. things. The machinery, the automation, and so Correct. on. Correct. Right? Yeah. Okay. But I also noticed there's something very interesting that um, that Levain Group doesn't just do turnkey solutions. You've got some f &B products as well, right? Yes. What are those just, you know, <laughs> what are the okay. other area of business that you do? Uh, okay, well, we have our own uh, frozen factories, mm. okay, that we usually export um, the frozen premium breads, mm. okay, to um, locally and also export as well. So our breads are actually ready to eat, okay, uh, once you try it, okay, I believe you will love it. <laughs> 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 because you're okay. basically your restaurants, you do not need any chef. And you can actually produce a very high quality uh, of bread, uh, which can serve in minutes or even in seconds. Right. Yeah. yeah. So are we saying that your 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 products or your solution <laughs> is going to replace uh, culinary? Uh, uh, no, <laughs> not really. <laughs> because right. like uh, they have uh, every business, we have our own um, uh, way of doing it. Mm. But what we want is because we want to provide maybe convenience to people. Mm that if they really want to go into FMB, so we are just providing, sharing our experience and to provide a probably a more convenient solution for them. Right. Yeah. Okay, perhaps you can tell all our audience and the industry players out there, what is it now with, with COVID situation moving on? What is it that you can share with them uh, in terms of solutions that you provide? How can it help them, you know, in this pandemic situation or rather in this, you know, very, very, change lifestyle situation yeah. yeah because we can see during this pandemic there are a lot of businesses they are facing a lot of uh, closing down mm. difficulties mm. because they um they simply don't want to change or they don't dare to change mm. so uh what we can share is no matter how life has to go on mm. okay if you are already invested your money in fmb yeah. why not just walk out from the circle mm. okay learn what technology can do for you all and how you can actually transform because I can see also many of our clients, especially the manufacturing line, they are doing really good during this pandemic. Maybe. Yeah, so yeah. there are people around uh, that can actually help out. Mm. So uh, dare to speak up, tell right. people your problem so mm. that others can assist you as well. Wow, mm. I love that. I love what she just said, you know, about that part about, you know, seeking for help. So those of you who are in need of um, any form of assistance, in terms of your F&B business, do give a give a call, give a shout out to the bank group. They're all here for you. They're providing an A to Z solution, all under one roof, and they will definitely be able to find a way out for you. So we've come to the end of our session with Levain Group. We'd like to thank Kevin Liu, the co-founder of Levain, for sharing her insights with us on Hospitality Asia Channel. Do look out for our next session where we will be talking to two amazing um, gentlemen who are very experts in their own field about evolution and innovation in the tourism industry. We'll see you then, stay tuned.